cows are one of my favourite animals. They're very useful. I think they're very pretty animals to look at. And I know how hard-working they are as well. So I appreciate they're good mums, they're hard-working mums. Look at this cow that's coming towards us now. She's black and white, she's looking at us. She's got very, very dark ears, a dark face and a little bit of white. She's got beautiful big ears, which have got yellow tags in them, which tell us what her number is. She's also got her tail flipping as well, because it's a warm day today. She's trying to keep herself cool. If you get a chance to look closely at a cow, look at their eyes. Look how deep and brown they are. They're very liquid eyes. They're very beautiful. They're very expressive. I like to think you can see what they're thinking when you look into their eyes. They're very calming, cows are. Just a few moments ago we were out with some cows in the field and they're quite far away. Now we're really close to some cows. We've got some close up to, to our girls. Uh, they're in a barn. We've got about ten of them here. They're indoors because very soon they're going to give birth to their calves. This is a chance to get really up close and personal with them. So they're coming up close. They've got really big heads and big flappy ears which are flapping backwards and forwards. I've got some silage in my hand which is pickled grass basically and they absolutely love it. They're all coming up and putting their big long tongues out. Can you hear them? Snuffling away and they're munching that silage, they love it. They absolutely love it, good girls. <coughs> Cow's tongues are fascinating. They're really rough and that grips the grass. So if you sit in the middle of a field and listen, you can hear the cows tearing the grass up with their tongues. They're like lawn mowers. We chop things off with our teeth, whereas cows do it with their tongues, and they're very good at it. As I touch them, I'm stroking their heads. It's quite silky. They've got very wet noses. Very, very wet. As they come close, they're sniffing, so I can see and feel and smell them, but they can also see and feel and smell me. And obviously I smell different to a cow. I also feel different. My skin is different to theirs. So they're getting quite interested into what I am. Where I'm standing now, I'm surrounded by cows. I've got the cows that have been milked eating their evening meal. I've got the cows that are about to have their babies having an evening snack and I've got the baby calves who are having their tea as well and I've got the loveliest smell it's a warm reassuring countryside smell and at the end of the day it's the smell of the farm it's the smell of my clothes and it's the smell of my life <laughs>